If you're looking for the best 6.5 speakers, here's a list you must see. We made this list based on our personal preference and sorted it based on their features, prices, quality, durability, and reputation of the manufacturers and customer feedback. Also, we've included options for every type of customer. So let's get started. At the first position of our list, we have a SD Audio A650. First up is a commendable pair of 6.5-inch beauties. They make for a great indoor slash outdoor two-way option. Due to their all-weather versatility, they are of a solid construction and come in a classic black or white finish. The frequency response on the OSD audio is fairly wide, ranging from 37HC to 20KHC. The enclosure is ported for better bass response, but with the outdoor use in mind, the circuitry and internal components are completely sealed and duly protected. The driver is impressive and then the power handling goes from 10 150 watts. They are lightweight with compact dimensions and come with matching mounting brackets, which swivel 180 degrees. They are reasonably priced for weatherproof speakers, but of course, you will already have to have an amplifier or system to hook them up to, or you will need to purchase one. Moving on to the next at number two with Rockford Fosgate Pro 165 X3. Our second speaker product that we are reviewing are a set of four three-way coaxial stereo speakers for mounting in your car. They are well-built and are CA2031 compliant speakers. Their powerful drivers have a peak power of 90 watts per speaker. The route mean squared power is 45 watts each. They feature a tiny half-inch silk tone piezoelectric tweeter to effectively deal with high-frequency audio. Having separate types of speakers designated to different frequency ranges gives a more natural representation of sound. High-frequency sounds will often be tinny without a dedicated tweeter. 6.5 inches is an ideal dimension for car door speakers. The set makes a pretty decent upgraded replacement with their additional tweeters. They weigh less than 10 ohms and are easy to mount. They have a mounting depth of 23-16 inches. The number three position is held by Kicker 43 DSC 6504. Another option, this time a two-way coaxial set to mount in your ride are these 6.5 pair from Kicker. They are surprisingly inexpensive for a set that is so well made. Some of the reviews in our opinion are a little unfair. Kicker makes some pretty decent, low-cost speakers, and we are inclined to think that some of the disappointment found with these guys is from bass heads, looking to deck their cars out in homage to the SBL Wars. If you aren't looking to pack your trunk with giant booming subwoofers, these are an expertly made duo. We feel they are powerfully loud, putting out a total of 240 watts with a great driven bass response for a 6.5, and that ultimately the low end handling is determined by your setup and the mounting and enclosure methods. They come with the necessary splice connectors for simple mounting. The components great quality, and they are adept for clear high-end frequencies. They make for an excellent car speaker upgrade and surpass most expectations given their appealing price tag. Next at number four, we have JBL GT A609C Premium 6.5 inch component speaker. Here we have a premium pair from JBL Fantastic High Fidelity GTO series, a perfect audio upgrade for your automobile. Their large carbon injected cones displace much more air than other 6.5 inch speakers in its class, essentially producing more bass. They feature patented uni pivot tweeters, so you can direct the sound to where you want it. They share dual level volume adjustment, which helps to compensate for less than idyllic placement. The components used are premium quality and well manufactured. They capably direct the highs and lows to their respective dedicated speakers. They are easy to install and have a mounting cutout diameter of 5, 1 16 inches and a mounting depth of 2 inches. They come in comfortably below the $100 mark. They weigh just under 6 ohms and are very low impedance. The number 5 position is held by Pioneer TSM-1676R. When it comes to speakers, Pioneer know a thing or two. Having dealt with consumer electronics for the best part of almost a century, the Tokyo-based corporation began life as a radio and speaker repair shop, and today they manufacture some of the best, selling on the current available market. This pair of 6.5 speakers have an impressive maximum output power of 320 watts and they are incredibly low priced for a high-class, three-way set. They come hot off of Pioneer's next-generation TSS series which have been refined and redesigned for optimal audio. 
They have improved base, a more dynamic range, and better power handling, as well as a trendy new facelift. They feature a new multi-layer mica matrix cone design surrounded by lightweight elastic polymer. The cone's rigid nature gives a much wider audio dispersion. The tweeter design has been radically improved. Overall, they provide lush stereo sound with deep bass and high fidelity natural soundings mids and highs. They effectively cope with high input power because of well thought out features such as their heat resistant voice coils along with the vented cooling baskets incorporated from their high end PRS spider designs. The number six position is dominated by BOS Audio CH6530. Up next is another exemplary pair of three-way class car speakers served up a super low price from Boss Audio Systems, fresh from their Chaos Series line. They feature piezoelectric tweeter which contains an active element that has been positively charged. Piezo speakers are much are less susceptible to overloading. The C's high frequency drivers cope better and don't require any crossover. They are low impedance. They feature durable poly-injected cones in a rubber surround, providing a highly responsive performance. The three-way nature produces a full-range sound dynamic which is practically unbeatable at this price level. Other design features include a high-temp voice coil which coupled with the heat-resistant piezo mean that these 6.5-inch bad boys with their eye-catching black and red aesthetics can handle up to 300 watts at a peak of 150 each. They are relatively simple to mount if you know what you are doing and require a depth of 2.1 inches. Moving on to the next at number 7 with Alpine SPS 610. Another good alternative for kitting out your car with, which have a mid-range wattage and fairly impressive two-way class specs, is this SPS set of two coaxial speakers. Each pack a punch of 80 watts RMS each totaling a 240 peak power together. A cheaper option to some of Alpine's best-selling speakers in the SBR range, for those with a more restrictive budget. They benefit from Alpine's knowledge and expertise and share some design features with their high-end lines. You could also try these speakers under 100. They produce full bodied sound with dual processing mids and highs are catered for, and the bass is a little more understated than some sets, but very rich with good depth. The drivers have great power handling, and the basket design provides adequate cooling for optimal high-frequency response. They weigh less than fibbles easy to install and have fairly nominal impedance, which is important especially with older cars that might have outdated circuitry. The number 8 position is held by Kenwood KFC 1695 PS. Of course, we couldn't sift through so many top car speakers without coming across a superb 6.5 offering from Kenwood. They are a high-performance set of two three-way class coaxial speakers. Each effectively copes with 150 watts with a peak of 320 respectively. They feature Kenwood's flush mount design and are extremely well crafted. They are affordably priced and the layout consists of two 1-2 paper cone, one 9-16 paper cone tweeter and one 2 ceramic super tweeter. They serve up a brighter sound with great clarity. The bass has a presence but is not overbearing with this pair setup. They have a versatile frequency response, which covers 75, 20,000 HC and very low impedance. Next at number nine, we have Sony 4XS and Pwn 1611. If you happen to be browsing speakers, looking for an upgrade for your boat, then the following offering from Sony will probably be the one for you. It is a stylish set of four dual cone, 6.5 inch marine speakers. They are X5 certified as water resistant enough for marine use. Sony has decades of experience and fabricates some great low-cost products, and these are no exception. They are lightweight but of a durable build and feature premium components. The dual drivers have surprising performance and cope with a fair input. They have 65 watts of RMS power, 130 per 4-pack, and maximum power of 140 watts. They produce good resonant sound with reasonable clarity. They have excellent circuitry with very low impedance and can be front or rear mounted with relative ease at the convenience of a few standard spade wires. They require a cutout of 4, 15 16 inches. They come in classic black or white, and they have a removable grill though it is disappointingly only plastic. Finally, the number 10 position is dominated by Infinity Kappa 62.11. Our final review for this article are this rugged pair of 6.5 coaxial speaker. They are two-way classified and extremely high fidelity. They have an ultra-low impedance, compensating for wiring quality elsewhere. 
The high frequencies are smoothly dealt with via its soft film edge woven fabric tweeter. They are carbon injected glass fiber material which copes well under peak pressures. The power handling on this max is out at a whopping 450 watts. The RMS power of each is 75 watts totaling 150 watts. They make for a remarkably noticeable upgrade to factory installed car speakers in terms of fidelity. The sound, in general, is pretty full range despite the two-way class. They feature proprietary plus one cone technology allowing them to provide more coner or than any other speaker in their class for unrivaled dispersion. They have modern aesthetics with their beautiful chrome inserts on the grill. They have no visible mounting screws. That's all for today. We upload tech product review videos every single day. So, don't forget to subscribe and hit the bell icon for the upcoming video notification.